Good afternoon everyone, I hope you're all well. The UK property market has been manipulated by the major developers, the government and the Bank of England for years. To give you an idea of the scale of this, there are currently over 1 million planning permissions throughout the UK that have been granted that are not being built on. 40% of planning permission granted in London is never built. This is an orchestrated and illegal campaign by the small number of large developers to control the market, to keep small developers out and to keep prices as high as possible for their increasingly smaller and smaller matchboxes that they are charging more and more every year. The government, by allowing not just fiscal drag on our income, but allowing inflation to basically wipe out the death tax allowance, which is a fraction of what it was a few years ago, purely by the fact that inflation has eroded it and property prices have increased, it begins to become clear that the government has turned into a financial grim reaper waiting for the over 65s who hold the majority of wealth in property throughout the country to die off so that they can get their grubby little hands on it. As for the Bank of England, keeping interest rates at a, an unrealistic low for so many years effectively encouraged the entire nation to borrow itself into oblivion and over this last year with 14 interest rate rises on the trot they've come to collect. How these interest rate rises are actually helping when the people who have been suffering most as a result of them are mainly tenants and businesses I really don't know but something needs to be done about this because the property market is not and should not be there to be exploited for taxes, to be exploited by the corporations. It should be there to house the British public and that's not actually what's happening. I'd like to hear your thoughts. Thank you very much and I'll see you next time. Bye bye for now.